Oh, all right. I'm getting right into this because I got to start the whole thing over. So, um, we're just going to go, 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 go. We're just going to go, go, go. I know how to play the game now, so it shouldn't be a problem. I'm going to move this over. Welcome back. Try to fix me. I didn't do anything. I just hopped on and was like, yeah, hell yeah, we're gonna do this. Configure video. I gotta uh, configure. Can't I can't use it while I'm running. I ain't ever running in this game. Wow, my shirt is. My shirt's gonna be sparkly today. Okay. I should be able to get up to there really quick. I know how to play the game now. Um, this should be no problem whatsoever. I just gotta. Jellyfish, another newcomer. Get the shit out of here. Um, I... I know what I want to do. I'm going to stay as a bird. I like being a bird. It's really, really easy. Uh, we know how to get through the maze. I probably don't even have to do any of this. I probably don't have to kill these, these jellies. Boy, wait, wait. Uh, yeah. I wish I had a, a good way of getting past that um that shark, but that shark was kind of that shark was kind of ferocious, to be honest. That shark that shark was really giving it to me. So I should be able to fly through this, cause I mean, um, once once I get the the bird. I know how to kill, well, the, yeah, the Sam Squanch. I know how to kill the girl Sam Squanch. Um, boy Sam Squanch, like I said, I was like, the boy Sam Squanch is way, way harder than the girl Sam Squanch. Mm -hmm. uh, the girl is really easy. Oh my gosh, I can hear myself, mute myself. I also know, um, I want to upgrade my jaw really early so I can just one hit things. So let's see if I can upgrade my jaws now. No, I need a little bit more. But yeah, I really like this game, so I have no I have no qualms with playing it over. It's it's easy enough. It's easy in the right places and hard in the right places where uh, I don't feel like uh, Secret of Mana. Secret of Mana was a little bit different, you know. That was. Also a good game in different ways, but I consider I consider this to be better than Secret of Mana. Uh, it's a little more my style. Yeah. That's like I said, that's my personal preference. Uh, I never say people have to agree with what I'm saying, but I consider this I consider this to be much much better of a a game than. Than Secret of Mana. I feel a lot of people probably agree. I think Secret of Mana, maybe Secret of Mana was was innovative and came out first, and that's why it sticks. But uh, this game, uh, I strongly believe, is a more fun. Maybe it's because of maybe it's because of the the whole. Uh, Secret of Mana is a co-op game, which gives it bonus points in people's eyes. But as a, as just playing the game, I know, just throw them on the ground. So if anybody likes this game and wanted to see, see more of it, you're getting more of it. And, uh, that's fine, you know. I really enjoy this game, so I don't mind having to play it from the top. I can just hit R to leave any time, but I'm just eating stuff to hurry up and get through it. Uh, but the shark fight, the shark fight, uh, you get them to run into, you get them to run into the wall. And that's that. I don't know how much, how much of what I need, but I do think I remember this is the level with the jewel. I think this level has the jewel. But, yeah, we can just munch on these guys, and we can one-hit them, and then we get two things of food, so this is a great place to just level up right off the bat. 
And we know that... We know that we want to get bird really quick. Because, obviously, bird... Bird's really good. So I want to get bird as fast as possible. I'm going to rush bird. Hey there, try eating the red cr crystal. We can... Boom! Turn into... What is this? This eel thing? Yo, ultimate... Hero, ultimate, ultimate, ultimate mega hero. We're playing, we're playing this. I had a ram crash. I was on the last section and we were on easy street. Uh, but it didn't save. So I have to go through and beat the game all over again. I, I really don't care. I think this game is, I think this game is utterly fantastic. So it doesn't bother me one bit to play it over. Uh, I think the trigger for the volcano is eating a bunch of these guys, but I'm I'm not 100% on that. Oh. And we exit we exit stage right, so oh hopefully I don't know the minimal the minimal stuff we want in order to beat this. Uh, I'm not versed in the speed run. It's that game that's about things that eat things and evolve. Yes, it is. Fantastic game. We are. We will be more than a fish. Look at this little guy. So I actually don't know what triggers the volcano to go off, but boy, 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 boy. But as you notice, I I don't have a frown on my face because this game is so much fun to play that I really could care less that I have to play it over. I, it's just, I'm going to be completely honest. This game is so much fun and so well designed and has so so much fun to be had with it that I could probably... This is one of those games where I could speedrun this game and uh, it would be like, you know what I mean? It would just be another game on on my totem of things that I ran because I just think it's so much fun. Yeah, I don't know if this can be really considered an RPG. It's an action. It definitely has the RPG elements. But um action RPG might be the best the best way to describe it. I'm going to get hit by probably one more boulder and then I'm going to evolve um probably my body to uh shell body. And then I'll have enough defense to get through this area. So there you go. Otherwise, that next rock would have instantly killed me. I could also have got a dorsal fin, but look how much look how many rocks you're gonna get hit by. A dorsal fin would have uh, just I would have flown to the edge really fast. But look how many rocks you get hit by in this area. It's best just to get the armored body. I am role-playing as a fish who grows and evolves. So maybe those come out in the same pattern. I haven't played this game enough to know enough about it. I don't even know if I want to go up here and munch on these guys. I think, I think honestly, I should probably go into this next area and fight these shark guys. But I also am going to want... Um, a fin. So I'll just upgrade my fin now. Make me a little faster and it'll help me dodge these sharks in this next area because they're going to come at me and I go under them and then bite them in the tail. I bite them in the ass. Otherwise they'll do this. So having the extra armor really helps here. Yeah, it's still... I still can't, I still can't go toe-to-toe to, toe to toe with them yet. But they give 50. As you can see, you can kind of just mash through them. These guys right here, though. 40. It's still worth it just to uh, grab these guys at the right, the right spot, and then you can just mash through them. Get your 50. Uh, go over here. Uh, I think this jewel is blue jewel. It's going to give me hella experience. And now I can... Ooh, I'm just a little bit off. I gotta kill a couple more things, but we're gonna go on our way. Yeah, I really like this game, and like I said, it's really, really fun. But 
it's on that, like you said, it's on that border of is this an RPG or is this just a an action game with weird upgrade elements? Who's to say? I always considered an RPG to be more more along the lines of weaknesses and stuff, if that makes sense. Like, um, people, I gotta turn my volume down. It's way too loud. It's blasting in my ear. Um, see, some people even argue that, like, Skyrim was close to not being an RPG because they took so much of the statting element out of it. And it was more of a just get the dragon bone shit and stab people in the back. It was more of just an action game type of thing with a little bit of shit thrown in here and there. And they they say the last real RPG uh, Elder Scrolls was Morrowind. Uh, I didn't. I never played Morrowind. I played Oblivion. I played Oblivion more than I played Skyrim. And still hold strong that. Oh God, this is gonna kill me. I gotta evolve. What do I got? 200. Uh, probably just upgrade. Oh, I can't get I can't get the better tail. I'll just get this tail just to save me on HP. I hate fighting these things because they just bounce and hit you. I don't know why I even bothered going up against them. I knew it. I knew what I was getting myself into there. So I got my I got my tail. I got my fin so that I could better get through that volcanic section right there. I knew it was coming up, so. I don't know the best places to grind for experience. Um, that's that's the shark. I believe those the Dunklio. So what? What are Dunklio? I can't say. I can't figure out half the time what these dino names are. Um, it took me forever just to figure out that, uh, like a, a Celio can. Yeah, is that like a Dunkasaurus? Like Dunky? This game is a masterpiece. Dunkasaurus Rex. I always using a Saurus Rex to add, to add to things like, um, you know, like Shitosaurus Rex, Assosaurus Rex, anything. Yeah, and then I like to picture it with instead of giant Tyrannosaurus jaws, it would just be an ass on the top of a. A Tyrannosaurus, and it's a Shitosaurus Rex. So, if this is the Shark Boss, I'm probably gonna die. But I think the Shark Boss is in the next stage. Yeah, the Shark Boss is up here. And I have to go fight it. Um, I don't know if I upgraded my jaw to the top of the jaw. Cave of Origin. I... Sorry, I got a kitty up here, and I have to um, pause and show this cat what's up. Oh, fuck yeah. Yeah, you learned your shit, didn't you? Look at that. He just going ape shit. Wants to jump everywhere. Your log's behind me. My log's behind me now? Yeah, he freaked the fuck out and just started patting his claws everywhere like an asshole. He'll figure it out eventually. Like, like there's... There's 18 million windows he could go to, and he chooses to go to the one window that's just gonna fuck with my shit. And he's gonna learn! One of these days he'll learn. The other cat learned. He doesn't fuck with it anymore. Yeah, he, he learned his lesson. The problem is he'll, like, unplug things if he does Yeah, he unplugs things, turns things off, because he just doesn't give a shit, and just doesn't know how to do anything, and he'll so just... before you feel bad, we have a whole, like, we have a sliding back door. That's just all window, so he could just sit by that. You can't show any mercy. I showed him mercy one time, and now he thinks he can walk all over the place. He can't. I taught him that. He can't walk all over the place. I'll show him what's up. You can't. You can't. Just like that. Just like that mom and daughter that were like straight up, like valley kid. Yeah, they're valley kid. Yeah. And okay, I got the best jaws. My fin's okay. My tail's okay. Uh, I could get a bigger body for more HP, but we'll see what this guy chunks me for. The seaweed whisper to one another something about this shark. Look, let me see what he says. Trying to create a new world. Yeah. Whatever. Get out of here. Get. Get. Okay. 
Get out of here. All right, now we're at the shark domain. Uh, I can just mollywomp these sharks, hopefully, and get some experience. Look at that. 80 experience. Keep it going. I don't know if I should fight those sharks over and over again, but it really does help to have a lot of uh, evolution points so that when it comes time to fight the boss, if I get hit, I can just evolve the evolve. Otherwise, I should be able to wombo combo him in the corner. I know that I can, but getting him to do it and not clip through the ground sometimes is pretty difficult. So, oh, look at that. Look at that. He got me with a, a bite into a, a tail wag or whatever the hell that Pokemon move is. Tail whip? We got too many Pokemon moves now. I don't know. I don't know my Pokemon. Like anybody, like anybody I know actually used status ailment things in Pokemon. Everybody just always went straight attack. It was always, it was always attack, 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 attack. Look at that guy. Look at that dickhead. Thinks he's going to get me with his dumb ass, go up in the air and stab you with a cone attack. What a shitty attack. Now this guy though, he's, he uses a uh, pinball strat. He just um, bounces around like an asshole. I don't want to fight them though. They're useless for me to fight. I just want to fight sharks and sharks only. So I got a shitload of, um, I got a shitload of shit. I don't know if I want to increase my body size though. I feel like staying small might be better at this point in the game. Uh, being faster couldn't hurt and having a better tail couldn't hurt. So I have two big evolves, hands and feet. Whoa. See, I'm, I'm at a, I know the boss is coming up. But I don't, I don't know if I want to fight it, is the problem. I don't know if I want to fight it yet. Not because um, it's impossible at this rate, but he might chunk me for 20. He might chunk me for 26 if he hits me. Oh, he hits me for 14. So we're going to see if we can eat some seaweed. He hit a wall somewhere. It's not well balanced unless it's PvP. Yep. I agree. Oh, so let's get let's get our dorsal fin going. Okay, so he's gonna come straight up at us right here. And oh god, see what I mean? Like You might you might be able to um get him with some other fancy shit, but I mean look at that. Boom, got me with a tail whap again. I figured being small might help. I might be able to dodge more of his shit. Like. So I'm thinking if I sit right here. I can keep him. I can keep him right here. And keep him going into shit. Oh shit. This is going to be a spooky one. He'll kill me if he hits me here actually. I'm going to have to. Um. If we upgrade this tail, I'm just going to upgrade to this tail, who has has no soul, two thumbs, and a pizza. Um, I've never, I haven't heard this one before, it's a new joke, it's a hot new joke. Sit right here. Oh, shit. I don't know that joke. It's that new age kid joke. He's gonna come at me up here. Oh, God. Oh, uh, nope, I got that fin. How do you miss the in uppercase this guy part? Wait, how do you miss the in uppercase this guy part? Huh? Oh, I read that. <laughs> just fuck. I'm just fudging with you. I'm just trying to find what's cheap to upgrade. What? What is going on here? There. Every little... Every time I evolve, I get more HP, so... Uh, I have the best jaw, so at this point, it's just... It's just down to dodging him and upgrading... He's probably going to hit me again. Let me eat all this shit. 
There we go. He's dead. Cool thing about this game is all the all the stuff that's over there that flew off the, the screen, it'll slowly clip back in to where I can eat it. They actually thought of that. Ah, there's there's our shark shark battle. I can't hit R to leave. I guess I have to exit stage left. I'm just pulling your pulling your chain. All right, oxygen world uh, exits right there. Now I know. Last time I didn't. I exited all the way left and then didn't know. All right, so we are already up to this section. Age of Fish has ended. We're now going to the Amphibian stage. I'm going to evolve into an Amphibian, a dopey looking Amphibian. And now we can continue onward. Look at that. Chapter one, already done. Chapter one is already done. Congrats on your pizza though. Congrats on your pizza. So I know the whole game, I know this whole game up until the the final section, which is where I ended last time, but it didn't save, so we're just going to probably finish this game. Uh, I estimate three hours, four hours. I can't remember where, where to level up in this section. This section I actually uh, don't care for very much. So, oh. No, I don't I don't even need to eat that. It doesn't give me anything. That just tells me something about evolving. Uh this section sucks. I I think it was I want to kill a bunch of bees. I think I want to get to the bee section and kill a bunch of them. So this is the empty land and a hop. I hear whispering something about bad bee or giant insects eating plants. We're going to mash through all this. Ooh. I'm a little dopey guy still. What do you say? I can't remember what that one is. I think that's just a green orb that lets me transform back into something, if I so please. So now I have one of those orbs saved up. This would have been a nice addition to the SNES Classic. There are so many games that that are unknown that should have been on the SNES Classic, but... They probably couldn't get the rights to this one because it's a square game. Or not a square game, an Enix game. But they did get, um... What did they get? They got uh, Final Fantasy V. One of those Final Fantasies, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know nothing about no Final Fantasy. I don't know shit about Final Fantasy. On to the next one. All right, these guys. They'll give me 10 at least. 10 is garbage. Not very helpful. I don't know, she's around, doing great. <laughs> One, two. Hey, Aaron, heaven. Uh, we have to do this. I know you were here yesterday. We have to do this whole game over. Uh, it took me about 20 minutes to get back. Well, yeah, 20 minutes to get back up to this part. Um, oop. 20 minutes to get back up here. Yeah, I prefer... I prefer... Uh, it feel It rolls off my tongue. Like, um, I like the sub name, like, Iceheart, Air and Iceheart, the Heaven's Fury. You know, like how, how they'll be like, introducing blah 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 into Smash Bros, the, the plumber from another mother. Yeah, they, they got Final Fantasy VI, Secret of Mana, Mario RPG. But this one got swept under the rug. So they hit you for, what, two when they do a jump attack? So 
I try to get them to jump over me. Now they go to sleep. Got him in the ass. Caught him sleeping. They probably felt it would have been... They wanted to stick in there what people remember being good. It was more of a big marketing thing for them than anything else. You put the games in there that you want to market. Kind of like how... Kind of like how Smash Bros. doesn't necessarily put in the... Or I should say kind of like how uh, Marvel vs. Capcom doesn't put in the best characters, they put in the characters that Disney feels is going to market the best for their movies, which is why Infinite was shocked full of um, these shitty characters that nobody gives two rats asses about, and then they cut like Doctor Doom and Wolverine and shit. Uh, the characters people actually want in the game. Probably the best. Oh, shit. This guy might kill me. Yeah, he killed me. Fuck. There goes 200 points. Uh, I'm just trying to blast through this. I should have probably upgraded something, but I was waiting until the next screen to do that. How the hell do you cut out Wolverine? Yeah, that's, that's my thought. Even though... I mean, Wolverine was godlike in Marvel vs. Capcom 3. He was ass in Capcom 2 and... or MVC 2. And... in Ultimate, he was he was kinda... kinda trash in Ultimate. But he was still usable, you know? He was a... he was a mid-tier, a sneaky... a sneaky guy to pick. You get him with the dive kicks, it was a pretty good bounce. But then they nerfed that because he was too good. It's like cutting out Batman. Cutting out Wolverine is like cutting out Batman. Oh jeez, I'm gonna die here unless I upgrade. I'm gonna get Wombo comboed right here until death. Uh, what can I buy to upgrade right off the bat? So I have 200, I'll just buy this and upgrade my jaw so I get max HP again. I am- oh my gosh, see? See what I mean? He's getting Wombo comboed. I'm gonna just die. I should have just died to save time. I got my upgrade, that's all I need. This is the section I was worried about, is, um... This one? Yeah, this section I think is harder, because once I get to the bird section, I know how to scam. I know how to bird scam really well, so I can... Once I get to the bird, I'm good. Like, the rest of the game is gonna be a cakewalk. This is the only section I'm worried about, because there's no real good spot to grind in this area up until the... From this section forward on to the... Until I get to the bees. And then from the bees, uh, it's going to be easy except for the boss fight. Uh, the king the king bee. Not the... The queen bee is easy. We uh, first tried the queen bee. It's... This boss fight could be hard too. Yeah, god damn. You know what you're talking about. Wolverine came, or Wolverine was good, and then Virgil came and was just fucking stupid. And that's when I lost interest in the game. I was like, I really don't like this character. And it's like, if you don't run, if you don't run Virgil Dante, your team was ass. Something like that. And I mean, like, something like, something like that, as in, it was pretty much every single, oh god, yeah, I can't do this fight until I have more damage. Um, the, the Virgil Dante spam was just, it just made the game not fun to me. I don't think I can fight this guy until I get a better jaw, so I'm going to have to sit here and grind it out in here. Um, yeah, Virgil Dante. Just made the game not fun to me. Maybe it would have been fun if I would have learned those characters, but, I mean, you know who was re really actually balanced was like somebody like Zero, don't like Virgil. No, I don't. I never played Virgil. Uh, I found him to be quite unbalanced. Where Zero was like a glass cannon. That's how I feel. I feel like... Um, no, I'm saying the character in the game. Not like the character character. I'm saying in the game, he was so... It was like so overpowered of a character that it made picking other teams not good at the highest level.
But what can I can't really talk much shit. Yeah, he's hella broken. That's that's why I didn't like it. I like it to be balanced, and in saying that, I was like a I was I was a a god with like early sentinel before they nerfed his health lower to one million. And then they took away his OTG rocket punch into hard drive, I believe. Or did they take away his his OTG rocket punch into ball? I think they took away his OTG into hard drive and then kind of killed one of his big setups, so you had to use him a little bit different, but he was overpowered too. But he was overpowered in MVC2 as well. So it evens out, but if you're going to make one character... If you're gonna make one character like so overly broken and then just be like, no, this character's too broken, let's fix him. And then release another character a year later that's just as broken, if not more so broken. Uh, I don't I don't understand their their point there. But yeah, I had lots of teams I played in there. I played Amaterasu. Um, I'm like Max, don't care apart balance as much as fun. If it wasn't Marvel, it's as if Marvel was ever known for its balance. Yeah, it wasn't. There's always like those the top tier, the top tier like six characters, the the good assist characters, um, and you try to make what works. But it, that works when you leave a game alone. If you leave a game alone and it's broken, it's fine in my book. But they kept trying to like change things and push change the meta. The same thing they're doing with. Um, Marvel, or not Marvel, uh, Street Fighter V, and as soon as they did the first, the first change in Marvel, an easy fix is to make everyone broken. That's, I agree completely with that statement. Uh, they, when you try and, you try and plug one hole in the boat, you just create more holes in the boat. So just leave the, leave the boat full with one hole, and see if people can find their own plugs to that, that hole. Don't try and fix it yourselves, because you, as a programmer, will often leave oversights unless something is a big major problem like the OTG uh, time scam, where you used to be able to do a certain uh, combo, and then it was like a cutscene, and then you would do another super, and then it would scam the person out. I think it was originally you would do a super into um a tag whatever the tag out move is and then that would lock all the players out and then the timer would run down and you'd automatically win that's things that need fixed not character specific things unless it's seen as a really actually a really really big problem of course this is me a uh what you could call just a casual person saying this but there's probably lots of actual good people at the game that would agree I never got very good with that. The only thing I can tout is the thing I already said, that I was like a top 100 E Honda back in Super Street Fighter uh, 4 days. Uh, what game? We're talking about Marvel 3. I love games where lots of characters are, where they can be broken, but, you know, it goes hand in, hand and foot. You gotta have some form of balance, but broken fun... Broken fun is broken fun. You can't fight that. But it stinks when the character that you like isn't the broken fun one. But yeah, I used to play, like... I played a lot of things. I played Amaterasu. I played Mo... I was... I was one of the leading Modocs for a while. Like, one of the only Modocs. Like, showing off lots of crazy things. But then the, the execution on Modoc is so hard that nobody wants to play it. They just want to play the easy... The easy wombo combo, zero to death, touch to death kills. They don't want to play the, uh, the shit Modoc with a huge hitbox, whose combos are fucking hard to do. Hand and foot, I guess. Hand in hand. Uh, yeah, I used to play some, I used to play some wonky teams in that, and, nah. They want fast and easy. I used to play some really wonky teams. So they can get the Evo and lose. <laughs> I'm a I'm a pretty big I, I pretty pretty much don't care about much stuff like that. I I went to one I went to one Smash tournament, made it out of pools, and my friend didn't, so I just left. I was like, well, you're just gonna powder around if I sit here and play until finals, so I'll just leave. 
I placed top 100th. I made it to top 32 in our Smash thing, and then just left. I didn't even play my first 32 match, I was just out. I think that's how, it wasn't very many people, it's just a, I mean it was a lot of people, it was at least a hundred, but. Oh shit. Respect it, but you don't like it. I, um... Yeah, Modok was in Mortal Kombat 3. Or Mortal Kombat. <laughs> Marvel vs. Capcom 3. He was there. Uh, I might have been one of the only people using him. But I, I worked it hard. Using those, uh, whatever fucking orbs. Those intelligence orbs. Racking them up and then just one-shotting people with a combo. You pretty much rack up. The strategy goes like this. It's kind of like how people tried to make Frank work in the next one. You would uh, you would build up your your intelligence orbs or whatever the heck they were, the cubes, on the first the first person. You would kill the first person with it, and depending on who came in, whether it be Phoenix or whatever, you would just one shot Phoenix to get her out of there. It was a really good strategy, but the execution is so hard that nobody would ever want to play that character other than other than me and in laggy conditions it was nigh unplayable he's an infinite too as a background <laughs> i haven't even touched infinite i was so disappointed with street fighter 5 street fighter 5 i played uh i played nash i played nash and nash alone and would fucking mollywomp fools until uh until infiltration exposed how easy how easy it is to play nash keep away and then they literally nerfed the character because he was so good with them and then that ruined it for me because i played the i played the infiltration keep away style because his, his dashes were so quick and it it was it worked wonders for me until they nerfed him and then i i immediately stopped playing the game i was one of the sore the sore losers if you know what i'm talking about when your character gets nerfed mm-hmm People fell for it, though. Like, the netcode was so bad that you couldn't... You honestly could not combat Nash's playstyle with the bad netcode. And they probably looked at the Nash win rate and saw that it was crazy good because the character... In combination with it. Armika. Armika, I never played, but she was... Um, one of the few people that I was... I always struggled with because it was a 50-50 mix-up game. Um, didn't like the Mika sensor. Yeah, they... They censored her hard. Poor gal. Alright, now we have enough for the scaly body. Free butts? Free butts. Yeah, she was she was she was cool. Uh this is something I could probably talk about because I dedicated a lot of time to getting good at those games. Ooh, my thumb's thumb is cracking today. Uh, Nikali. I, I actually, I really like playing, um, there we go. I really like playing, uh, I really like Grapplers, so I thought I'd like Armika, and then it just didn't click, and for some reason, out of everybody, fake-ass, Super Saiyan-looking motherfucker. Can I hit R? No, I gotta leave this way. Okay, so that takes care of that jackass, and we can leave. I really need to... I need to up my uh, fins and stuff so I can get moving faster, but... <laughs> Some sense of realism, but it could have been worse. Could have been worse. Um... Game. 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 Could you, could you let me leave? There we go, game. Thank you. <laughs> Fucking game. <sighs> Everybody knows. Ooh, and blurred the screen using a rainbow flash. True that. Ooh. You have to. You have to know. Her name's Rainbow. That's what the R stands for. And she is a girl wrestler that was wearing like a 
like a one like a onesie type like a onesie you know yeah, thing like, like wrestlers wear you know yeah. it showed too much like ass yeah it showed too much ass though so people complained i think <laughs> i know i wasn't complaining i didn't give a shit oh think of the children they're gonna see all that ass all that ass she slapped her booty yeah, because she would, like, she's a wrestler, and she would, like, slam her ass into people, you know, and do a bunch of wrestling moves, but that was too overly sexualized. Americans are weird. They just get, <laughs> they get all grossed out and stuff, like, ah! Oh, this! She's showing her butt! It's like... Too much ass. Here's the thing. It's like, I'm gonna be completely, completely real. It's like, people can't they can't control themselves and it's just like this just makes me want to bang and makes me feel funny i can't have this it's like just control your fucking dick <laughs> retard i'm just gonna be i'm being straight up like just control your shit Maybe they can't. i can't i can't handle it I am a I I am 13 and sexually attracted to 3D models. Help. <laughs> and 2D models. models. There's no problem with it. There's no problem. You want to like you want to like um and 1D models. <laughs> and 1D models. I, if I got the game for you, I won't. So the bees are what I want. The bees give uh, hella experience. Look at my experience. Eating the babies this time? Uh, eating the babies is good. Like I said, it balances your health out to where if you kill a baby and kill... You're curious of what? I missed something. Uh, Arctic, don't even get me started on balls. Yeah, I like. I had a couple of slammers back in the day. Yeah, they were, they were stupid. Damn it. I never get that emotion. <laughs> Are you typing it or clicking it? Because, yeah, it didn't work again. <laughs> yeah, Craigasm. It's, it's a hard one. No, I'm saying. It's a hard one. Which one is that? What? Uh, we want that jump and do ourselves in. We need this. Yeah, good old. What? I can't remember. That is, um, what's that guy's name? I, I forgot his name. It's been so long since I watched his stream. Not that talk I'm talking about. <laughs> All right, so shit gets real at nighttime. Ooh, I love when you get the wings. Yeah, I really love. I really like that. Not, Not pogs, plugs. Plugs. I know. Pog, Pog champ. champ will do. <laughs> do you guys know the the evolution of Pog Champ? I feel so weird because I have the shirt because I've been following Mike Ross and Gutex for yeah, you have a shirt of it. forever. Like showed on that thing. literally, I have been watching Mike Ross and Gutex forever. Forever. My inspiration. They are my my Street Fighter inspiration. To be completely honest. Oh shit. Yeah. Report. I didn't, I missed that one. He was too high up. Poganese. Poggers? I don't know the history. <laughs> you don't know the history of PogChamp? I don't know if you're being facetious or if you really do, man. Uh, I will play the video. So, Mike Ross and Ryan Gutierrez Gutex are, are Street Fighter players who have been around the block a few times and 
times. <laughs> yeah. And it it's great. They used to make funny uh, things to market products, you know? And one of them was they I like I said, I'll play it. They were playing they're playing pogs. Yeah, we had to restart. Oh, we get more Evo action. More Evo action. Oh, come on. And this one doesn't bother me playing it at all. I really, really like this game. I uh, just gotta... I wish I could bite twice in air, but... Right, I've decided. You've decided. Artists decided. I'm gonna start routing my... Metabots? You like that? I watched you play... The I, I shouldn't say I watched you play. I should say I watched. I'm getting wombo comboed, so I'm gonna hit R to just get out. <laughs> I'm glad you enjoy it. Wait, what happened when yesterday when I saved? I just uh, left it on and it RAM crashed on me and didn't save the actual save into RAM. It happens to me all the time, to be honest. Uh, that's why I try to leave the the system on 24/7. Because I get a lot. I've gotten so many RAM crashes. It's what's ha it's what happened to uh, Secret of Mana too. It ram crashed on me and didn't save. Oh, yeah. It has happened Yeah. It happened with something else, but eh, it's no biggie. I'm just grabbing some Evo points. We should be okay. We should be okay to fight the uh the Queen Bee right now, actually. But I want I want a lot of uh I need to get the upgraded armor in order to get past the sand part. Damn, I'm just having the worst luck. Yeah, that's what happened when I had to run through. This game is a fun grind, yeah. It's not like a boring kill things grind. It's literally you kind of have to try. And then you have to eat the food. It, it balances out really well, other than these right here. Sometimes I can't grab those. That that bee came out of nowhere. Little Kim. <laughs> queen bee, little, little Kim. Kim the queen bee. You mean Beyonce? Yeah, I That's Beyonce was like yeah. world leader of Illuminati. By the way, plus I got accepted to work at the liquor store. Oh, congrats. Working at the liquor store. What were you doing earlier, Slice? I saw you were playing or doing creative, but I missed it. When I went to cook on it, you were already out of there. I stream in creative when I... No, I don't. So, our... So, our... Well, our... No, that was Lil' Kim. Okay. Competitive Smash is for children. Competitive Smash? Uh, I only play Melee because you can say whatever you want. It's the only one that's actually complex. Um, you can hate all you want. You can hate all you want, but uh, the other ones, I would, they're just, they're party games that people want to be fighting games. Is Evo the equivalent of the kitty pool? Uh. Brawl is complex because of tripping. Every Monday I take your class too. I think, Wait, what did you do? I think Brawl is the worst. I never thought Brawl was good. I was gonna buy a Wii to get into Brawl because I like Melee so much, and then I played it at a friend's house, and then I never looked back. I thought the game was complete trash. It had the best story mode, though. The story mode was really cool. It even had another one of my favorite characters, Snake. <laughs> I will argue that all night, try me. Sick of bashing. Oh my gosh, I forgot I need to actually get out of here, otherwise these these assholes will kill me. Big money! Big prizes! Because of my sick wings. I did a gift for your friend Mule because he inspired me to do them. Hmm. hmm. Interesting. Cool. Reported. Bro. Not liking Brawl. Do you really like Brawl? Wolf is the best character. Not the best in the game. I thought I thought Meta Knight was the best and he was so good that they had to ban him from tournaments because he was too good. <laughs> I thought he was the best. 
And then Diddy Kong, I thought they said said was really good. They said Diddy Kong was really good. In the year, I told you. You need ten brain cells to use Meta Knight. Cool. I can use Meta Knight. Um, if anybody is wondering, I I did play the new one. I think I think it's an excellent I think it's an excellent party game. Fun for the whole family. But then when one person gets good, then it ruins the game for everybody else. <laughs> it's just how the game goes. It's I can't I can't play Smash 4 either. It it drives me insane. I don't like Smash 4 uh, competitive. I don't really like many of them. I don't think Brawl is, is tourney worthy. They literally added trip mechanic to make it less competitive. Yeah. Uh yeah. I don't I can play See, I'm in the vein of uh, I played competitive melee, so you can't forget you can't forget once you know how to do it. It took so long to get so good that I just don't play... I can't play with people anymore. It, I have explained this many a time. Uh, they get mad if they play because I can play every character better than they can play the characters because I do that. And then... it's You make it a party game and the only way it works is if you have items, but then... Most of the time when they play, they want to turn off items, too. And it's like, okay, so why would you take the steps to make it closer to the competitive, like, bracket, so to speak? But then you want to turn... you, But then you won't get good. And then complain when somebody's better. It is fun with no items. I don't think Brawl is turning worthy. They literally add the trip mechanic to make it less competitive. That is the fact. It just looks like wave dash spam. Yeah, buddy. Just look at the wave dash spam. Yeah. Just look at that. Mm -hmm. I don't argue any of it. Item makes it Mario Party. Yeah, it makes it random. That's why they cut items out. I'm also in the same group of people that's like, if you have to put too many rules on your game to make it competitive, it probably shouldn't be a co competitive game. And they don't like that. I love the joke, though, that it's a baby game because all the players are toxic. They're toxic. It's nothing but rules. Yeah, that's what ruins it. But it's fun to have two people to just play if you have a friend to play it with, but don't listen to me. I think once you find your your game, you stick to it. Sleep apnea? Is it where you can't breathe in your sleep? I don't think I have sleep apnea, but I could. I don't think I have sleep apnea. I definitely have some form of I can't go to sleep and I'll stay up for like 20 hours. I, my mom actually has this. I think it's when you stop breathing. When you stop breathing while you're sleeping, so it keeps you awake. They act. Who who acts like they they don't care? Uh, in Call of Duty. I'm pretty sure the reason a lot of people play Call of Duty and Counter-Strike is because there's money in it. It's not because the game is good. Insomnia. Yeah, I Hi, Mr. Bucket. Let's play. Hey, Mr. Bucket. Mr. Bucket. I used to play, yeah, I used to play Overwatch 2. I used to play Counter-Strike. I used to play Diablo 3. Um, this guy's dead. I think we both have him. FGC is toxic. It's the problem with folks talking games, taking games too serious. Is this the original Spore? This is the original Spore. It's so much better than Spore. I I used to play Spore with Mr. Bucket a little bit, I believe. I'm drinking a big boy drink today. 
Um, I had to deal with Valley Girls to get you that. Oh. Well, once you tell someone they're good, yeah. Ugh. I gotta get up to 5,000 and grab this extra armor. Someone else's game is better being paid. Everyone uh. thinks they are on that level. This is one of the best games I've ever played on uh, Super Nintendo. One of the best. Yeah, it's really cool. And you're like flying through it now too. Yeah, other than the the fact that I'm still not the best, I don't know the best uh, grind strats. The what? Uh, no, because I can't fly yet. When I when I start to fly, I gotta look for some new stuff. Oh, we got a double kill. Got another one. So I need 5,000, get the best armor that I can get right now. People watch top players and mentally think, I'm a top player now. <laughs> yeah, lots of people do that. No one is better than me. I do that too. I watch these top speedrunners and I'm like, yeah, I'm the best. I'm the best there ever was. Nah, I'm not. I'm trash and I know it. I'm trash and I know it. Shit drives me insane. Because you have to deal with the fallout of the stupidity. The stupidity fallout. And you have people learning things they shouldn't know. Oh, because they're watching them and then being like, oh, well, I know how to do that now. Yeah. I see. But in some veins, it's an act. Because a couple of people got called out on making fake feuds for the sake of the viewers and being exciting. And I thought that was actually a good idea. And I support that. <laughs> I think it makes it more exciting if you do that. Otherwise, it's just watching a couple of kids playing a game they try to make it into a, a fun act so to speak i don't know what you were talking about i'm amazing it's my teammates who always suck oh yeah i want a fake feud i want a fake feud fake feud i'd fake feud hey so that's all i did all that grinding so that i could take that guy out real quick Hey, I had that come across many a time. Um, play Fortnite rando squads, and you'll figure out real quick that maybe you aren't the problem. <laughs> hey, guys, we're going to land here. One idiot goes and lands on the complete opposite side of the map and proceeds to complain when he dies and no one's there to revive him. Uh oh. I'm tired of my Oh, I walked right into that one. Yeah, this this will be fine though cuz I already upgraded to max armor. So, that's fine. We got through. Uh it was pretty bad, but we got through. Why did nobody Why nobody land with me? Facetious, but yeah, sometimes it's really hard. My favorite was when that little kid was like telling you what to do when you were the only one still alive. Yeah, that kid was pretty funny. I I probably should have clipped that from when I played um, Fortnite. The kid telling me how to play the game, telling me to play more aggressive, and um. Wait, aren't you fucking dead? He per didn't say that. Yeah, I he proceeded to he proceeded after that to oh my god, this guy knows how to hit me with his tail. I Fucker. Didn't tell me I sucked. <laughs> yeah, I have kids tell me that and I'm like, why am why are you dead then? What happened? Why are you dead and I suck well, and I'm still alive? You didn't land with me and protect me. 
Because you didn't. Because you didn't. You, you did. Because you didn't. It seems like you're putting a lot of the blame on me for your failures. Okay. Don't blame me for your life failures. Don't blame me that your mom didn't go and buy you skins. <laughs> you are my safety net. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God! Ooh, shit. These guys are brutal. 1v1 me IRL in a game that is balanced around... Like, I can't handle that that shit. I talked about this before. It's harsh truth about Smash, though. It's kind of a joke that for it to be competitive, you need CRTs, broken controllers, and a book of 10,000 rules to make a fun party game not fun. To make a fun party game not fun. Oh, sick burns. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I, I blatantly just said, like, I won't argue that shit. Like, I won't say nothing about that. Um, yes, broken controllers. I have I have controllers that I use for certain games and certain controllers I use for other certain games. Um, I told you, like, one of... It gets to that point. There's one controller I, like, I don't use. Oh, shit. I use this controller for TMNT because the button slides are better for my slides. These guys are actually assholes, and I shouldn't be fighting them. I should probably just be skipping this section. Quad burn. <laughs> a quad burn. Quad CRTs. I have a. Have I got a story for you guys? Have I got a story? There, people are so just they're so into this that there. I read a story one time about somebody who plays Link in Smash. They had a hacked copy of the game that the only difference was they changed the frame data on their character by like two frames to make him a little bit better than he should be so that they could compete and beat out certain moves that like Fox would have and stuff and they caught him they caught him on it because he had a hacked version of the game Wait, that's fucking pathetic Becoming anorexic. Like, is he eating? Well, then Arctic was like, I thought that was a space bot quote. <laughs> yeah. I'm gay. Is your brother okay, though? Hopefully, everything's okay. Eat that. <sighs> oh, these ones are just bad yeah, enough, these ones. Huh? Like, yeah, I don't. I don't actually need to fight any of these guys. I just kind of have to go fight that uh, B boss. Yeah. It's a. It's a joke. I. My I. Computers. I mean, my control is working perfectly fine. I'm not competing. I only lost because my stick right here. I normally play with a broken stick that lets me uh, do this. And I say the same thing about speedruns. There's people that'll be. Like, the no modified controllers and whatnot, or no turbo button, but then people can, like, they can break their controller, they can modify it, because it's still, like, what? Oh, shit, he already whacked me one. I am, I'm dead as shit here, unless I hit this. Nope, I'm dead. Okay, I have to change this. Well, that's gross, dude. <laughs> so I gotta get a short. In order to get the, uh, the stun. The stun on this guy, I have to get a short hop into, uh, this. And then I can stun him on the ground and get a couple hits in. Last time I got a perfect one cycle, but... Now I'm just jumping on his head. Which part oh. is pathetic? The fact the guy has to think? Or the fact the community noticed two frames of difference? Oh, shit. <laughs> um, I go, I go with the hacking of Link. Why? Because I could probably tell the difference, to be honest. I know what moves shouldn't beat out. I, I don't think... <laughs> By biting my tongue, I don't think you guys know 
how how deep I've gone into the Smash rabbit hole. Oh my god, you are two frames faster. <laughs> and to to keep going with the story, when we went, somebody was they run these weird setups at um they run these weird ass setups when you go to tournaments and we were like this setup is all blinky like we were like this shit what's going on like it was blinking something was up with the setup so we plugged our gamecube in and then the organizers flipped their shit like they were like we had this pre set up and blah 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 ah, and started yelling at us and then i just looked at the dude and i was just like just shut the fuck up we're playing a goddamn game this kid, keep in mind, whoever was organizing this was in one of my college courses, never talked to me again after that. I was just like, we're playing a fucking game. Do you think I really, do you think, do you think we really give a shit? He shut up real quick and walked away. You are systematically breaking the game. Dude kicks power Like, we're like, look at this. We plugged it back in and we're like, look at this. Do we have to come over and have you show us how to plug in a fucking console? We just plugged it in. <laughs> but we spent hours setting this up. You spent hours plugging in GameCubes to fucking CRT TVs? You spent hours. Well, hey, it doesn't affect balance. Get the hell out of here. I'll see you in Calc 2, motherfucker. Now I'm the dopey sloth. I thought you were the cooler. We spent hours rigging it. We spent hours to plug in these game cubes, and you just came in and plugged in your game cube? We had the bamboozle cube set up, and you bring your own non hot game cube? I'm sick of you, Boy Scout. You want to know what the best part about this was? I was playing a random person. I wasn't playing anybody I knew, and he agreed with what I was doing. He's like, I can't play on this, dude. And I was like, okay, don't worry. I got one in my backpack. And I plugged it in and unplugged theirs, and he he flipped his shit on me. And I was like, idiots, I swear to God. I won't. They were playing, they had some weird, like, Wii setup. Like, they were playing on, the one that we were playing on, because they had, like, probably 30 different consoles set up for it to get through the pools faster. They were playing on some Wii setup, and we both agreed. We were like, this TV is shit, this console is shit, it's just not working the way it should. So we just took matters into our own hands, and they threw a goddamn bitch fit. Can you tell Pikachu is four frames slow on his console? I think, um, if you want to know, I think he changed a lot of things on Link. I think he changed, like, knockback percentage to where somebody who knows how to DI a grab, it didn't DI properly. Don't, I, like, don't get me started on this. Like, please don't. I've been down, been down and I haven't played in, like, two years. I just don't play anymore. Don't play anymore. Did he give Link a chain grab? Ha! Link's grab is a chain. That's a joke that only select few get. I'll see myself out. What do you mean? You're you're curious about what? <laughs> Did he give him a chain grab? I thought I thought you were making a, a like a joke because he uses the the chain as his grab. Let me smash, please. No. <laughs> what else? His grab? No, his grab is the hook shot. It's a chain. So I thought you're making a. I thought you were making a really, really uh, clever joke there. Like, did he make his grab? Did he make his grab a chain grab? I hope that's what. It was. I hope that's what it was. <laughs> but now I'm running to 
but now I'm running thin. Why bother hacking? What's the fun of winning if it isn't honest winning? Because you're probably not popular and you're not good at anything else, so you cheat to win so you can get some sort of recognition. Money doesn't care about That's how you true. get it. <laughs> It's the same thing we talked about, I talked about with you. If somebody cheats, if somebody cheats and puts a game, a speed run up on the board, and they get caught, and they get called out on it, their run gets removed, but they still have 500 viewers because they've gained so much popularity since that point, do you think all 500 of those viewers are going to leave that came because of that speed run? Or are they going to stay? They're obviously, like you said, they're probably going to stay. That's that's it. All it is, is you lie once, get away with it, and you become the president. Everybody knows you lied. Everybody knows you lied, but they just won't say anything about it. I guess they just don't care. I think that site's down now. By the way, use the use that negative notoriety. Get. <laughs> Is that... I said that wrong. Notoriety. And... Write it. Write it to the top. Oh. Took all of it down? Yeah, um, I'm pretty sure that site that I was using. It turns out that <laughs> the wife cheated. If you guys don't know what he's talking about, he's talking about a, um, he's talking about some of that AGDQ fun stuff going on at AGDQ. So I should one-hit these guys now, and now I can grind up. And we're almost to the we're almost to the the end of the game, pretty much. You know what I mean? Like as soon as Dopey Sloth Dragon guy or Sloth Reptile has played his part, we turn into a bird and I fly I fly through the rest of the game, both literally and figuratively. <laughs> I might have to shrink my body down though. I can't. I can't quite recall if I want to shrink my body down. I know that I got to collect a thousand to become bipedal. Whew. I'm curious about the guy who cheated. Let me go see. Yep. Yeah. Go check out that guy who cheated. We're going to be done with this game so fast, though, now that I know how to play it. Uh, I believe this is Triceratops, pissy Triceratops that we can't kill. Err, uh, I'm angry. Watch your kids, son. Oh, I'm dead. Fuck me. I'd really prefer it if you'd be quiet <laughs> right now. Oh, that one's the best one. That and you know, so you know what's great about that kid too? That kid got caught cheating too. That I'd really prefer it if you were to if you were to be quiet right now. Uh, the guy that said that? No, the kid that was like supposed to be quiet. Yeah. He got oh, caught. Yeah. He got caught cheating. He got caught. He. Yeah, you had it right the first time. He hacked, uh, well, I shouldn't say he hacked. When I say hacked, I mean they went in and no, because other talented people write the scripts out for games and write passwords out. Not passwords, but what values do what. And he scripted it so that a jump in, Super, or in Paper Mario Thousand Year Door, a jump would go uh, three, three, not three frames higher, but... Oh, it's I don't know how you judge the distance basically just three pixels higher giving him uh, like five extra frames to make a jump 
and then they caught him on it because uh, they just were like, dude, we can tell you jumped, like, these three little f things higher in your thing. And then he changed his name on Twitch. <laughs> and... Yeah. Like, he did that. Do you jump too high? Because... I I just don't get it. I just don't... I don't see why people care. As in, why do, why do people care enough to cheat? And then... Uh, I'm sorry, I'm still laughing. I'd really prefer it. I'd really prefer it if you were just to be quiet right now. <laughs> I hate to get into it, but the, the stuff cracks me up. I don't understand. Uh, Caveman, Caveman's okay. I, I don't know, like, uh, he's a saint for dealing with that one, though. Yeah. Like, he kept his mouth shut. Like, I would have been like, if you don't get off of this right, if you don't get off of sitting next to me right now, I'm going to put a, a baklava on and beat your ass outside, and no one will ever know it's me. Do you understand? Do you understand? Do you, words that are out do, you, do you understand what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, do you, no, I probably wouldn't have done that. I'm kidding. I would not have done that. I'm not an angry person. I you would have. Probably would have said the same. I feel like you wouldn't have been as nice about. I. Trying to be quiet, but. <laughs> I would not have beat him up. Don't think I'm, I would actually beat him up. Never would I ever. Then they'd probably call it a hate crime because he was like, I just didn't know I have autism. He used that as an excuse. He said he has, he's like on the spectrum. He used it as an excuse. And then, then you get pity points. And it's like, oh, he didn't, he didn't know. I don't know. I tried to be nicer. <laughs> I mean, he was pretty nice. He, I don't, like, I don't know, like, uh, and that, that right there was the start of the downfall of AGDQ. After that, they were like, we can't have stuff like this happening anymore. We can't have fun anymore, because if we start having fun, then, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, oh, damn, this is the hard one where I have to, Actually, what I did last time was I hit him all the way over to one side. I think I want to be small, though. I think I want to be a small bird, because you move faster. If you remember, I did swap between the two, and switching body styles and switching neck styles are the same amount of cost and points. So, oh, I can just run right past him. If I don't jump on him, he doesn't fight me. I never knew that. <laughs> you try to be nicer. Yeah, I wouldn't actually be mean. I'd just be like, please, please, sir, I, you are very, you are very annoying and you shouldn't be here. Why didn't he say something at the start, though? I was laughing because I didn't know it was if he didn't know him. He called him an autistic. Uh, he, he called him names. He called him very scientifically accurate names based upon... Damn, I don't have the jaw to, to excuse me, but your breath stinks. <laughs> I have gingivitis. Oh, shit. Then please don't talk within one foot of my vicinity. Brush your teeth. Don't talk within one foot of my vicinity. Yes. I, oh my god. I need a bigger... I can't get over him. Can I just jump over him? That's not how it works. So, you can jump over these guys if you stay... If I brush it, it could kill me? Sir. That whole, that whole thing was weird, but... Can I just run past these guys? I've never tried to just run right through them. 
I feel like they hurt you. But I can do this. I don't want to fight these. If I can just get if I can just get past them, I'll get to the part with the guys that I do want to fight. This is where it gets hard though, is when they put their heads down, they accidentally hit you. There we go. I can just do that and tank the damage. I am Gingivitis. I don't want it to seem like I'm hating just to hate. I'm just making jokes. This guy. I just feel um probably could have thought what he was doing over a little bit better. Don't be stupid. Excuses, you know. He tried to talk to him after it, is what I heard. And he didn't care for that either. He was just like, Look, you already made me mad enough. You know when you make... You know when you got, you got a friend or something, and you make them mad, and then they're just like, I'm cool, just, you know, chill out for a little bit. Mm -hmm. And you keep pushing the fact. You probably shouldn't push the fact. You should just say... You know, I'm sorry. Nowadays, everything seems like hate. Imagine if I punched him. People. People. I make the jokes, but one of these days, one of these... One of these people are really going to take it to heart, you know? One of these days, somebody's going to get real upset. What do you think? I, this is this is not what I don't... I don't want anybody, anybody to think this is what I'm saying. That this is anything that I would do. But what, what happens if something, you know, actually, like, bad happens at one of these events? Would they stop doing them? Like, I want to... I want to know... No, their con their contingency plan for for this sort of thing like something actually bad yeah, happening when do I evolve into Miley Cyrus why my big old long neck I was gonna say when do I evolve into Ron Jeremy <laughs> I gotta eat some bugs Yeah. What do you mean Donkey Kong Country is not the greatest video game ever made? Uh, ooh, fight breaks out. Why would something bad happen? It does it doesn't take much to trigger these kids these days. It does not take much to trigger kids these days. DLC Estony. What do you mean you don't like it? House of Glass was one of the greatest uh, DLCs ever made. Well, it's, a it's a big event, and there's lots of people there. I just don't. I just feel like. I feel like it'd be like I said, where they would just like continue to have it, and then I'd be like. Can I actually peck these guys now? I can. Mm-hmm. I don't really care. Like the shuttle bus outburst. Oh shuttle man. Bus outburst. Yeah, somebody on there like <laughs> I Somebody said something about you go just look up the sh the shuttle bus AGDQ. Okay. Um I can't remember exactly how it was worded, but I know what he's talking about, and you know what? I laughed. I thought it was funny. I thought it was funny. Mostly because they don't know how to handle it. It's like they don't know how to handle uh, criticism. Uh, they can only handle positivity, you know? You gotta... You gotta start, stop putting yourself in this perfectly. He was telling jokes in 90s style. You gotta let yourself be open to criticism. If you don't, 
then you're just gonna get hurt by everything and just sit in your room and cry about it. Just don't, don't do that. Sit in your room and cry. At least that's how I feel, you know? Sometimes bad things happen. Sometimes good things happen. Breeding a generation of loose leaf paper is... Did you make that up? That is like, <laughs> that is one of the most brutal insults. Like, most intelligent way of putting it. Just absolutely... <laughs> oh, shit. oh my god. They, they're essentially the what you ran into at the store today. Yeah. Like. Yeah, they were freaking Like how they always say, uh, people who maybe were in a like a lower income place and then they move to a higher income place. And they're like, man, you guys act all like like you want to act ghetto because you see it in all the rap music videos, but you wouldn't last a day out like where I grew up type of thing. Like you would act that shit, but not really back it up. You can talk, you can talk it, but you can't, you can talk it, but you can't like be it. Um, yeah, it's from there. To be or not to be. Now, that's not me. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying this. It's like that story. Oh, kill some frog. That is my society. Like, I've talked about it before. Um, I grew up... Uh, what did this guy just say to me? I grew up uh, poor, poor side of like rich person town. Wrong. I grew up wrong side of the tracks. So I, I had to go to school with like people who, who were like getting new Mustangs as gifts. Oh my God! He just one hit me right there. That was really bad. Like people, and uh. I mean, I have a nice car, but I paid for it. Like, thinking that's what I needed to fit in, you know? Nah, I didn't need it. I shouldn't have bought it. It was a waste of money. It was a good one. Oh my god. No! Eat up! Oh, these frogs are gonna kill you, dude. So that guy's gonna come back. Uh, I think a lot of people are never coming back to AGDQ. God damn. Oh, this is this is the part I was worried about though. Up until everything up until this point. Like I got to fight I got to fight this guy and I probably need to upgrade my fin so I can move a little bit faster. I actually don't want to fight this. Games done quick has become too babyified. Well, it might have always been. I don't, don't, I don't know. The problem is they took such a cool, like, idea of, like, getting people together to do, you know, run games that they enjoy. Mm hmm And it. Turned it into, like, a, a pissing contest of sorts some ways. This is talking about spaces for safe sure has me envious of all the spare cash everyone seems to have. They, back in the day, it seems like they had a, a lot of fun and now it's chat only because people want to say that they just want to say things. But, you know, you know what? I talked about it. It's 
You gotta be a robot. Hello. Okay, but my name is Fluffy. Today I will be running Turtles in Time so Normal. And then they would just ban you. And then say, thanks for the money, you fine young gentleman, because they won't even say anything. They'll just ban you. They wouldn't even tell you why you're banned. I'm trying. Dying. <laughs> mm-hmm. They don't care. They'll take it, you know? And that's... I mean, that's the big... I... Oreo told me that somebody... That somebody sub... Like, somebody donated a bunch of money and said, Can you, can we have, like, sub only... Or, can we free the, uh, the plebs? Mm -hmm. Can we have, like chat be free for a little bit and then they the guy just laughed and said no I remember that too. and that's the biggest insult and they probably did something to that guy like oh you made us look like you made us look so bad by doing that ban like, no. no I don't think so I think you like <laughs> <laughs> no oh you're so funny it was great. It's inflated. Who's to say that it wouldn't happen if I had an event? That it would slowly turn into a cesspool of me making jokes and hurting oh, people's you. feelings. Oh my god. I don't have enough for a horn. You are trying to horn in on my action, aren't you? <laughs> they also probably do With the, with the, oh no, I'm getting insta-killed by these frogs now. With the level, with the level of, oh my gosh. With the level of money they have coming in, there's no doubt in my mind. He just said, with all that money involved. With all that money involved. <clears throat> I already said, the, the only really big thing that bothers me is they, if you, even if you're not going to pay for the, uh, Oh, I almost got it. Even if you're not going to pay for the runners to get there, or pay, or even if you're not going to pay for the runners to do their thing, at least pay for their, their hotel or some shit, you know? That's that's the least Just you could do. They could probably get a discount too. <laughs> yeah, I know they could. I've been to... I've been to cons, and they get a huge discount because of... It's like across the 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 mass surge of people and commerce that it brings is totally worth it for them to oh god oh god he still got me oh my god i don't know what this his hp value is at but i probably need to upgrade my my hp flow stack unless i can get him with a wombo this guy's not too bad to get with the wombo as long as they take one step and bite so first off i have to walk forward oh shit walk for oh god no he's gonna get me here i'm inside i'm inside i'm just gonna go for the kill on him as long as i get the wombo how can those tiny frogs even do damage to me <laughs> the the monstrous dinosaur and these frogs are just like licking me and jumping into me and it hurts me I was just checking. Yeah, it's not, it's not that hard to get a discount when you're a big event like that. But, oh no, it's it's charity. It has different standards. We can't. But don't ask me. I don't know the logistics of running an event like that. Well, they should. They've ran quite a few. They've, yeah, they've ran at least uh, ten of them. So, I guess you're right. That's not really Oh. Oh. So, I think last time when I was doing this fight, I had a little bit more, uh... I had a little bit more bite power, so I could just, uh, spam that guy. Hey guys, we're totally running a cancer research drive. Please donate all the monies. 
Oh my gosh. I think I'm gonna have to go level up my jaw so I can just e easily kill this guy. This... Last time I just think I poked him. I don't know the, the frog's HP. I really don't. Uh, they showed their... They're, they're non-profit, so they, they have to, by law, display their, um... Oh, that was the one right there. I should have just kept poking away at him. Okay. Oh, he's gonna kill me. Mmm. They have to display where their money goes, and... I want to say the last time I saw it, it was like $250,000 goes towards just to the people. Just to the people that organize it. Which, I mean, is fair in a regard, but you're telling me that not like you couldn't even give like a thousand bucks you're get you got two hundred and fifty thousand bucks or dollars and you're telling me you couldn't just give a thousand dollars to every runner who runs a game there you know what i mean like a thousand bucks isn't that much when you're breaking in a million dollars a thousand dollars per the runner And I'm not that anti anti it. I used to really, really enjoy it, but then, but then it just it, it like shut up, play the game. Yeah. The money. And you know what? I'm not into that. We didn't ask you to speak. We asked you to play. Yeah, I'm into the people, not not the act like a robot. If you could just, <laughs> if you could just like do a robot voice. Because we don't actually like want you to sound like yourself. You know, we're trying to get some money here for charity. It's boring as fuck. And if you step out of line, they just a tiny bit to take you out for good. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. what I'm saying. That pro that one guy probably. I mean, not that he would come back maybe, but the guy that said the name about the shuttle bus would probably see him. And I I already said this. I've said this to uh, Mr. Mr. Bucket. I said this to, um, you know, I might get in. I, I could probably get in on a submission. No cosplay allowed? No cosplay allowed anymore they don't either. Play cosplay at all? No, you have, I don't even, I don't know why. I think something what? about sexual assault. So instead of. Instead of fighting the real problem, uh, dirty ass perverts. Hey, Oreo! Instead of fighting the real problem, dirty perverts, they go after the people that just wanna be themselves and dress up, which I don't agree with, you know? Um, it's, it's kind of, it kind of goes with the, the frame of, you know, I'm not, I'm not here to like bash somebody if they're like a furry, you know? I'm not here to bash somebody if that's what they're into. I'm not into it, but I'm not here to insult you. That's I'm not going to sit there and insult you about that. I don't I don't care. That's what you enjoy and if it makes you happy, it makes you happy. Don't insult me. I'm a pervert. Don't insult me. I'm a pervert. But I respect people's personal space. Yeah. One of the comments was, "Would well, or would you yell obnoxious noises during a, pis a piano recital?" No, that would be rude. What the audience was doing here was pretty rude, and then someone goes, Speedrunners are way more accustomed to background noises than mu musicians. Besides, they wear headphones so they can hear the game audio. I, I'm going to be honest with you guys. If I plug both my headphones in, I can't hear shit you say. Yeah. And you're sitting like three feet away from me. Mm -hmm. I can't hear shit you say. They also said like the announcer didn't try to do anything. All things this guy has said. Kill yourself. I mean, I might think something is really weird or whatever, but I'll never speak, at, speak it out loud. I just speak it to myself and think about it instead. <laughs> 
How's it going, Oreo, by the way? Hello, are, Oreo. are you thinking about getting on today? Oh, Tomorrow? He, you know, he's in that constant, he's in that constant struggle of, uh, I get in it too, of, you know, do I really want to? And today I came in with a fucking passionist, passionist rage yeah. because my save got well, taken. Yeah, and I just need to get enough to get armor, I believe, maybe, and then I'll be okay. Think. I try to I try to find the good with the bad, you know. I try to find some trash in a game and some good in a game. I don't want to just, you know, like there's bad things about Gabe's mountain climbing adventure, but there's also good things about Gabe's mountain climbing adventure. Like you get to fight a fucking helicopter and then fight a guy on a helicopter. Yeah. Oh wait, no, that was the. Uh... Ooh, that was cool. Yeah, punching missiles back is funny. It sucks when you're picky all the time. Um, I I consider myself to be. Um, there's things I like to do. Like I always. Well, you get the dragon morph though. Um, it's at the top right corner, and if I go up in there, there's also a 9,000 whatever. Oh, what am I doing? I can actually just evolve here and get my armor body and go fight this thing. Sorry, What? So you're talking about being picky. Oh, no, it's fine. Uh, I don't know who the snarky British runner is, actually. Yeah. I'm trying to think. I probably know. Uh, so I went with... Oh, this is going to be a bad one. I already know it. What? He still hit me? B.S. Yeah, when I'm armored like this, I don't know that I like it. Well, he trashed good games to be funny. I just found it obnoxious, and he's trashing your favorite games. Yeah, people don't really care for that when you trash their favorite games, but... I can understand if you're just like, I don't really like this game, it's not really my thing. You don't have to be like, God, this game is the worst, you know what I mean? Yeah, I, um... Just state your opinion. But you can be funny about it. You know, I... You can be funny about it, but... Hey, well, in the in the case of some games where I can, I'm gonna use a movie for example. When I trash, when I trash Saw, and I'm like, this movie, this movie is absolutely trash. Like it's trash. Mm -hmm. You could be like, but I like Saw, and I, I can like be like, it, but, I'm just like eh. but you you're can't. To your own yeah, you're entitled to your own opinion, but at the same time, my opinion's wrong. <laughs> the no, I'm saying you can't really, you can't really argue. Like, pointing out, like, they made these big flaws in it. You can't be like, no, they didn't. Well, yeah. But I like Saw. And then I'll be like, that's... I just say Go ahead. that's flawed, but I still like it. Uh... I, like I just make... I just make jokes as they come along, but not try to find jokes to bash a game. Oh, no. Unless it's truly shitty. Like Krusty's Funhouse. I didn't Anyone like Anyone like Krusty's Funhouse? That's their favorite game? Wanna play a little game? Play a game? Wanna play a little game? Why can't I beat... I think I must have had the really powerful Jaws and then I just kind of whomped him really quick. Because it should work like this. I should jump. Bash, bash. My favorite. <laughs> My favorite. But I'm pretty sure you'll never find one of my insults being somewhere along the lines of just me not being good at something. 
like you're bad at it, so you hate it. Yeah, like I think a lot of people are just immediately would go to um I'm bad at it, so it's bad, and I've talked about that. The frogs are absolutely tearing me up today. I can't get them, but I think I don't want to grind and get the bigger mouth. I just want to one, two, three, four. Oh god. Maybe it's cuz my neck is too long. I too long of a neck. So, I'm just going to let these frogs hop at me and go to bounce town on them. So, this oh, this food right Oh no. The blinky food is what I want because These frogs are tearing me up, son. I'm just gonna stay right here. Oh, we know what's driving the evolution. What's surviving the evolution? Frogs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're pretty fucking brutal. Now you kill all the babies. I'm trying, I'm trying. Too old, they won't be able to reproduce. Ooh. Oh, game. <laughs> I'm so bad. I'm so <laughs> I'm so bad at the frog fight. What was that? I forgot all about the frog fight. Wanna play a little game? I look for logical, like straights through games though, you know or not through games, through movies. I look for the logic in um if they're acting how a person would actually act or if they're just acting a certain way in order to push the movie forward. And that's a big that's a big thing in really, really poorly written movies, like that one we watched the other day. That was, you know, it was, it wasn't a real movie, like movie movie. It was one of those, um, it was just like a B movie. A B movie, and I was it like, was like Ooh. someone who had a really good camera, enough money to buy a good camera, but wasn't good enough to get acting classes. Ding, ding, ding. That's a movie. And that's not saying I can't enjoy it. Like I really it like. It was still pretty funny to make fun of. Yeah, I like the room. The room's pretty funny. So, if I don't get good luck and... I was gonna say, if I don't get good luck and get, um... Meat from them, I'm gonna die. Man, I'm I'm bad at the frog fight. Frog fight's holding me up. If I just grind for biting power, I would be done, though. That's what stinks, but I don't want to have to go grind to eat... To just kill this guy, because as soon as I do... One, two, three, four. Ah, four. So, as soon as I see his stupid head, like, look at that. Oh. And then you're just. One, two, three. Oh, God, the frogs. Like, look at that. I'm gonna jump on top of them, but they jump and it hits me. Frogs are assholes. These, unless you get a blinky health, like that, you little shithead, he's just gonna hop on you, so we're gonna hope. Like, that did 10 damage, because he hopped into me. It's why I have given up. He's gonna hop on me. Look at this, I can't do anything. Samurai Cop has amazing acting. Does? I haven't seen it. I haven't seen Samurai Cop. I don't know if he's in that movie or if he wrote that movie, though. Is he in it or does he just act in it? Probably just acts in it. What's my what's my killing killing frog strat? So jump. Like that hits that chunks me for ten, and I I just don't believe. It should hit me. Okay, so here we go again. Jump. He's gonna land on me. Damn you, frog. Like that chunked me for 10? Like. Die, frog. I can't hit him. Last time, I'm pretty sure I had to end up grinding for. So what happens is that right there, the game slows down to a crawl. There's too many hoppers on screen. And I can't get a good I can't get a good bite off. So he's gonna shoot these frogs. If I get too close, he's gonna jump. 
This is gonna hit. Oh, it didn't hit me. It's fucking. I've been fighting him for so long, it turned to nighttime. A fantastic French chef. Oh, you little shit. He's gonna get me right here for sure. Oh, nope, that's it. Finally got him. Yeah, you just gotta wombo him in the corner. It's... And I can never get enough of these. Because you gotta... Oh, God. It's slowing down so bad. So, eat. Eat. I always miss two of them. We didn't have an armored body. That's fine. Yeah, I just had the big old chompers, didn't I? We did it! But yeah, um, continu continuity errors just drive me nuts, is all. Okay, it takes a lot of hits to kill these. But I have my armored body. Wait, I just realized. I don't need to fight any of these. We're almost, we're almost at the, uh, the section of the game where it's just done and over with, and we're good to go. I gotta go to the bathroom, though. I drink so much of my... My drink. Whee! monster. Look at my tail wiggle. <laughs> yeah. Alright, we're gonna go up to the castle. Hi, oh, they got that trivia channel. Alright, Mount Brave. There we go. Oh, he fucking got me. Oh, shit. 11 damage, here we go. 12 damage. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh. Dare you! All I have to do is get to the top. <sighs> I'm gonna go jump in the water, transform and transform back. That way I get my uh, HP. All I have to do is fall in the water, transform and get out. Oop. And then hit up. I just gotta climb to the top and then I can turn into a bird and then everything's fine. The problem is it's really hard to do that when you're uh, this thing. You pretty much have to sit here and poke him down. Like here he comes, boop. Here he comes, here he comes, here he comes. Oh, nope, he got me. Puts the X on my eye. Such an annoying section. If you get grabbed while you're climbing up, uh... Can you kill him? I can kill him. But there's a bunch of them. Oh, if one grabs you... Wow. 
I won't get fooled again. So who's saying? I can't believe I made it up this last time, first try. The stupid mountain. So maybe if I go up this this edge? Nope. I'm forced to go over this way. Maybe they'll be sleeping now that it's nighttime. <sighs> Alright, this guy. This is the real threat. Oh my gosh. Daylight savings goes... Wait, is this one the one that goes backwards or forwards? I don't know because my phone does it for me automatically. It went um, forward. Finally. So you gained... You lost an hour of sleep. Oh my gosh. I didn't jump. I thought I could just run off. Here I go. Oh my gosh. I hit R. I feel sleepy right now, to be honest. Yeah. I was up till like six in the morning watching anime movies. You piece of shit. <laughs> there we go. So I don't need any of these points because as soon as I turn into a bird, uh, you start your evolution over again anyway. So none of this stuff actually matters. There's no reason for me to grab that. If I get slammed at this point, I'm just going to fall all the way back down. If I get slammed, I'm going all back down because I'm an idiot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight? No. Okay. There we go. I guess the trigger to change is over on this side of the screen. Now I'm a giant dick bird again. I can hit R, get out of here. Um, the world of the mammals is over there, but we don't need to go there. If I knew where the thing was in this, um, in this cloud, it would be a little bit better. The world of the mammals. I'll go here. I actually don't know what what purpose this has. What nonsense. That's not how it really happens. Look at me. I'm a dick bird. So I don't know... I don't know how to get kick, but I want kick. If I could figure out how to get kick, I would be fine. Oh, he didn't stop there. Uh, so... I guess I can just push forward all the way to... Let's fly. Ooh, he looks so angry. I love it. There it is. Kick's pretty good. I wonder if I can do it down, down. Do a down, down kick. Dino's evolving into a bird? Yeah, dinos. They turned into birds. Alright. Tyrannosaurus. Insta-wrecked my shit. I guess I... I don't know what causes the stun. Because I... Last time, I had the perfect timed thing where I would hit him and then it would stun him and I could just hit him again. And then I did that until I had bite. 
but I don't think that's gonna work here. I'm gonna fly. The problem with these guys is they jump. Oh my gosh. I'm probably already dead here. So am I going to fly right, 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 right A and kick him? It's, it's really hard to get it going. Oops, I flew up here. I didn't want to do that, but I guess it's okay. Here we go. We've been in this cloud before. All the way up and to the right is uh, the dragon power up. Um, there's probably other things hidden in here, but... Ah, uh, there's that's one of the things that lets me change into something I've saved as. So I could grab the dragon power up and then save the dragon power up. And I can change back into it at a later time to fight some of the harder stuff that might come up. But I really don't even want to do this, to be completely honest with everybody. What do the dragon? Uh come into this cloud area. I really don't even want to do this. It was kind of an accident. It just automatically pushed me up here, and I don't really feel like doing it. Because it's just a giant maze. And I just hope that this, like, takes me out. I really don't want to do the maze. But... It looks like that's not going to be the case. Unless this takes me out. Nope. I really just don't want to be in here. That won't either. Can I... Can I just not be here? I can't even L and R to get out. I really don't, 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 do not, do not, 100% do not want to be in here. I don't want to bother with it. There are upgrades in here, but we can just upgrade. Like... With what I'm doing, it probably would be faster if I found it and then left, or like found whatever the orb is that upgrades you. Oh my gosh. I don't know how to get out of here now. Now I'm, now I'm done stuck. They put little, little thingies every once in a while so I don't get too confused and lost. But the dragon thing is up here, I believe somewhere on the right side I should have never came in here I know I should have never came came in here once I got pushed in here I could have just walked right flown right back out but since I'm here I can always do this change into a dragon Oh my gosh, a beautiful, beautiful dragon. A beautiful dragon. Name. Same thing as always, just call it ass. And we could use this to go fight Tyrannosaurus's. So I believe down and all the way to the left and then down will take me out. But I'm not sure. Down, left, cross my fingers. Not that way. No, that way's bad. Yeah, I don't know how to get out of here now. Um, up. Up, then left, and then down. I think this is it. This is a long tunnel. Alright. Now that we have the dragon, we can go to where the terrain or sorcerers are. The mystical Ath dragon of your mythical. The mystical, mythical Ath dragon of your. Ah! Oh. Piss off, dude. 
So I think this is... This fight is kill X amount of Tyrannosauruses. And then you get to go on to the next area. So... We're going to grind out some... We're going to grind these guys out a little bit. And get some wonderful, wonderful experience. Oh, there's one. So, we're changing back already. This sucks. We don't want to do that. So, we're going to immediately hit this. And we're going to go review. One chance to change into a creature recorded from an other log. We're going to evolve into the Ass Dragon. And we're going to kill a couple more of these guys. And that should speed this section up for me. Oh, he walks all dopey like, but he hops like a beast. <laughs> and chomps like a beast. I think 5,000 is what I want for. Oh, God. Get away. Stop! Well, that. That killed a lot of my experience gain right there. Stop it! And I believe I can just jump on out. Fly on out of here. Um, I use both of those to just make this go a little bit faster. So now I got a bunch of experience from those. Uh, now I'm going to go back to... I believe it's this area and kill a couple things level up and then I can eventually kill those things oh not these so you're having trouble flying there buddy so as far as I know oop, we can do a bunch of those I'm just gonna get out of here these things suck uh, I want things that I can just kind of blast through snap right through them and kill them and level up. I don't really need to level up right here. If I if I knew how to, it's like the same input as uh, Turtles in Time. Just constant kicking. Come on, dickhead! You can do it. One damage because I got my weak dick mouth. But look at that. Isn't that nice? I literally just... Really nice. You just fucking slide kick them. And you just wombo combo everything with it. Wombo. I need to stop using that. But <laughs> Wombo combo is, should only be refrained for... Uh, when there's two things getting hit. Left and right, left and right. That is a true wombo. But yeah, you have to be dashing, so you just dash kick, dash kick, dash kick, dash kick. And the moment you see his uh, foot come back, you have to be finishing your second your second uh, input. So I double dash hit once. And then the second dash input, because you have to double tap, uh, is tap the exact time that your uh, your feet comes come back to you so that you're not kicking. And then you just link it over and over again. And we can clear things out really fast. It's doing two damage, but the fact that you can just keep doing it, uh, the damage racks up really quick. And then add in the fact that you can do it in the air. And then you got... That one's a little harder because there's not as much of a visual cue. It's more of a uh, timing thing and having it down. But I mean, look at this. Pro footsie game right here. Bah. I haven't checked to see if if we can do it. We can, look. We can just go down and do it. We're we are gonna absolutely smash uh, with this. Cause we can go 
uh, we can just hover above things and then double tap down. Oh, shit. I can just... Oh, God. Don't smash me down here. You are the most annoying shit monsters ever. Look how slow I move. I can't even eat this stuff. Kick him right in the ass. But, yeah, we're gonna be flying into stuff and just be like this, and... I'll probably do that a lot. I literally just double tap down into the ground. One, two, three, four, five. Fly, eat. This is much, much quicker. And what do we want? We want these... We want these big-ass jaws right here. We want these Tyrannosaurus jaws. Uh, we'll get those in a little bit. Uh, we got plenty of time to get those. Uh, I think what I will do... I think I'll keep my neck like that. Uh, feather body we're gonna want. Uh, maybe these dorsal fins. I could probably buy this right now. Now I'll get going really quick. Evolution my tail. Ooh, we gotta get that long tail, bird's tail. Back of a head, a uh, horned helmet. Screw it. And then eventually we'll get more, more kick and power, but like, look at that. Now we can double kick. We just kick twice and they're dead. Does it still have a special place for me? Um, does Melee still have a special place for me? Uh, I could pick it up and play it, but do I want to go back and play it? No. I often get onto the Smash Ladder, the net play thing, and I just look at it and I'm like, no, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to play. But I look at it and then think, you know, I could play this, and then I don't. Wait. Will you join us? No. Holy shit! It's a lot of meat we got from that first one. I have no desire to go back and really play it. Nah. I like it. I like it, but... I... Bit it. I should have knocked him into the corner. I screwed myself. I need to focus on having him out in the clear. I have no corner... Corner dra or, uh, corner T-Rex combos. I got none of them corner T-Rex combos. I could have double tapped up. Oh shit! I'm gonna die. Mmm, I'm so bad at it in the air. I just lost like a thousand five hundred points because of that. Because I died twice to him. I want to stay on the ground, but he he jumped, didn't he? What did he do? That tripped me up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eat that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh. Man, yeah. Really it works, it's really good. The the big the big stinker here is Whoa. That's scary. That is really spooky. <laughs> I don't want to go that far. Once I get to those guys, 
It gets really spooky. I'm just going to keep it to one. <laughs> Slide kicks. It's pretty funny. Slide kicking. One, two, three, four, five. Poke, poke, poke. I gotta get out of here. That guy is too powerful and he's pushed to the corner. Corner fighting I can't do because I don't have a beak yet. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oof, that was a close one. Luckily, I knew that it was 10 hits. Otherwise, I would have ran away. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oof, that was a close one, too. When is it going? When are the asteroids coming? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, oh, fuck! He came forward and got me. I done screwed myself. I just need to kill the one, the two in the middle. Uh, what is it about melee, though? Uh, melee, though. N why not just move on to Smash 4 and deal with it? I mean, look at the uh, Street Fighter. They they aren't refusing to move past Third Strike. Um, it's a hard one. The mechanics are the mechanics are just far and beyond better and then you can be like well what's better i'd have to write a detailed summary out and you ask why why not move on uh i tried to move on and brawl had tripping which was annoying oh there's just lots of things that make it different it's about how accidentally broke the movement is. I think he got it. The intricacies of the hitboxes, the damage values, it's just the game is unintentionally very well balanced in a sense. I know there's uh, characters that are just better than others, but I mean, Third Strike was cool because of the parry mechanic and stuff, and st people still argue People still argue uh, Third Strike is the best. And... Why don't they still play Third Strike? Because Capcom doesn't want to support Third Strike. They want to make money. You can't make money off of a dead game, like a game that's been out for a long time. They want to sell more copies. And that's why Nintendo has never supported uh, the Smash fan base. They can't make more money off of new games. Yeah, the people had to make Melee what it is. And that's what makes it so special to some. Oh my fucking god. After all that, I got bit twice because of a miss, a miss dash. I'm not the best person to I'm not the best person to ask why why do why do people like the game so much? You'd have to ask each individual person. Because of the money. It's all about the money. Why do they play Street Fighter V? Is because the money is there. Capcom supports it so people play it, they can get money. It's got parries, it's got really good hitboxes, and you could say, well, what, what about Smash? Well, and, and Melee, if you frame perfect block, oh god, I'm gonna die here. If you frame perfect block in Melee, you also get the same effect as a parry. I, I keep screwing this up too bad. Uh, you'll, you'll gain all the frames from getting a perfect block, and then you can counter. And once it gets... Now, that's and something incredibly hard to do. But it's just the intricacies. Yeah. And the out people. There's also the casuals really drive it. Because if only professionals are buying the game, then you're not going to get anywhere. You got to make a game that's good for casual audience and good for professional field 
of players and they do it well but the casual or the the professionals play for the money that's all i'm going to say so if the money's there people are going to play and the popularity will stay up there and that's why counter strike is still popular they know they can't make a game they know they can't get everybody to switch so they just keep they keep counter strike popular it makes money brings money in so they keep doing it my frames are dead my stream is dead it's all about money. Yeah, they keep the casuals invested in League of Legends, then it stays popular. On a poverty level, League is trash. I play on poverty level. There we go. Oh shit. I'm almost, I'm almost there. I just got a big beefy ass 1000. It's like watching paint dry versus watching an alien invasion firsthand. Oh my gosh, my frames are going out the fucking window. Uh oh, I gotta get out of here. I've come too far. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Can I can I be done with this? Please? Can the I don't play League anymore. I never really did, to be to be completely honest. Okay. There we go. Now I'm on to the next part and I can gladly go to the bathroom as my frames go out the window. I'll be back in a second. I'll be back in one second. I just would like these frames to even out. If you guys can hear me, if you can hear me, frames are trying even out, please. Let me fix this camera so it's down lower where it should be. Frames even out, please. Don't die. Internet, please stop being stupid. Oh. <sighs> They have their own asses in their own heads. They watch pro, pro player and think the pro, probably. I need to... But to better answer the question, it's... Oh, my God. Let me wait until the frames even out, and then I'll answer this smash, this melee question. I'll grab my controller, and I'll explain all the intricacies of melee and why it sticks around and why the other ones don't. And then maybe... Maybe it's, it's a skill level, because... This, like, the internet is crashing straight up. It's dropping to zero over and over again. It's really annoying. So, give me a second. Hello, God. Look at that. 